Hi, Tammy Goble here, and you just finished the self mastery course upgrading your self esteem, ambitions, and relationships. And the reason why you do that course first before you go on to the second level mentoring is so that you can gain an excellent relationship with yourself first. You gotta have an amazing relationship with yourself, you gotta love yourself and appreciate who you are and what you do and the amazing thing things that you accomplish each day and get that accomplishment energy going and love who you are. It's not gonna happen overnight for some people. It's gonna take more than one or two tries at loving yourself. Keep doing those mirror exercises and keep doing your the, the, the 30 challenges to increase that love. Because once you love yourself, you can have a better relationship with all of those in your life. So the first relation, for the first challenge you're gonna to get today is to ask your love on a date. Do you remember back when you were 16 and you got asked out and that exciting feeling you got in your gut? If you wanna build a relationship, you have to bring that excitement back into your relationships. So this, if you're, you're the man or the woman, it doesn't matter. You need to get on the phone and call your love and invite them, ask them out on a date. You just get on the phone and say, hey, babe, how are you? Good, how are you? And just say, will you go out with me t Friday night? Or will you go out with me Saturday night? Whichever night's best for you. You actually say the words, will you go out with me? Will you go out with me stirs up excitement inside you. So your challenge is to ask your love to go out with you that night and to start that. You know, this is my second marriage. And 28 years ago, I got married for the first time. We've been, and I, with my spouse that I have now, we've been married for 20 years, coming up here in a few months, 20 years. But when we first got married, I had three little kids, three little girls under the age of five. Can you imagine? And, and my, my husband didn't have any children. And you know, his desire of wanting to be with, with me didn't happen as good as people that are married for the very first time and start developing a family together. He took on three little girls under the age of five. And so we decided that we needed not one date night, but two date nights. So we went out every Friday and every Saturday. Those weekends is what helped us carry us through the next week when we you know, started out a marriage like that, where it's not gonna be just the two of you all the time when, you're, when you've got a second marriage going on. And yeah, you get the little knocks on the door that says, mommy, I'm scared, and they wanna come sleep with you. It's like that. So there's obstacles when, you, when children are involved. Wonderful, beautiful obstacles though that we love so much. So if you're in a situation where you need two nights instead of one, go for it. I'll tell you what, it makes things happen faster. But call them up, ask them out on a date, and do the fun little thing that you used to do when you were a teenager get that giddy feeling back inside. Because I loved it when my husband calls me up and says, hey, you wanna go out Friday? It gets me excited inside and giddy. And so, and helps me make, look forward to Friday. So anyway, have an awesome day. 